there are so many companies in the stock market. How should you categorize it? Peter Lynch in his book One Upon Wall Street categorizes stocks to six major categories based upon their growth rate and their stock price movement. Slow growers, stalwarts, fast growers, cyclicals, turnarounds, and asset plays. Talking about the slow growers, these are the large and aging companies that used to be a fast growth stock some decades back. These type of companies have a growth rate of around 3% in US stock market. These companies pay out regular dividends to their shareholders because their scope of expansion is limited. Peter Lynch doesn't keep such stocks in his portfolio. An example of such companies, Alcoa. Talwards are multi-billion dollar companies whose earnings grow at a rate of 10 to 12% annually. Author mentions that he buys such stocks and sells them after it gains 30 to 50% and repeat the process with similar stocks. One more reason of having such stocks in the portfolio is that it is recession proof. Because being a big company, they don't go bankrupt easily and they restore their value once the recession is over. For example, Bristol Mayors had only one down quarter between 1968 and 1988. On the other hand, Kellogg's also had one down quarter during 1958 to 1988. Other examples of such stalwarts are Coca-Cola, Procter & Gamble, Fast Growers are small, aggressive new enterprises that grow at a rate of 20 to 25 percent annually. These are the multi-bagger stocks. Here you can find 10 to 40 baggers. For example, aluminium and plastic industries were the high growth industries in 1960s. It is to be noted that high growth stock do not necessarily belong from a high growth industry. For example, hotel business grows at around 2 percent yearly. But Marriott was able to generate 20% growth from 1978 to 1988 period. Other examples of such fast growth companies are Taco Bell in fast food business, Walmart in general store business, and Gap in retail clothing. Cyclical is a company whose sales and profits rise and fall in a cyclical fashion. Following kinds of industries are considered cyclical stocks. Automobile, tire, airlines, defense, chemical, steel. Usually, their stock price rise higher just after the recession because the economy opens up and the people are ready to purchase non-essential items like cars. Therefore, example of such companies include Ford Motors, AMR corporations. In order to attain profit in such companies, the timing is very important. Turnarounds are the companies that are most likely to fail. But it is to be noted that they can even come out successful when the restructuring of the business is done by the management. Example of such companies include Chrysler and Penn Central. Peter Lynch wants investors to be very careful with such stocks because they will have to keep up with the news of the latest, what is happening in the company, what the management is doing. Asset plays are companies whose total asset value is more than its market capitalization. In other words, asset to equity ratio is less than one for such companies. These companies are generally overlooked by Wall Street analysts. Example of such companies include Pebble Beach, New Hall Land and Farming and Liberty Corporation.